Hello, hi, assalamualaikum doctor. So this is a video that you ask uh, for us to upload in e-learning to test our MPI command in uh, Ubuntu and to uh, do some exercise whether to fix the error in the source code given in the MPI module. So first of all, let me open my virtual machine first. So this is my uh, I'm running Ubuntu in uh, VMware. So uh, we had to MPI folder to see I got two uh, C file here hello world.c and hello world1.c the hello world is uh, the very basic uh, the very basic uh, coding uh, just for the sake of to test our MPI command and the hello world1.c is the source code given in the MPI module uh, to for us to fix uh, the error given so uh, I show you to uh, I, I will demo how to run the hello world.c first. So I open my terminal, navigate to my desktop, and in my MPI folder. So from here we can list what we have in the MPI uh, folder. So I got hello world1.c and hello world.c here. Uh, so I can uh, create my uh, output file. So uh, put it test C. So as you can see we got no error uh, in compiling the C file and now I can uh, list one more time so I can see the test output file is already created so to display the output I can just use this command before uh, we can see the output uh, from process 0 out of 1 and hello world so this is a one time run process if we want to uh, specify how many times for the process to run we can use the, the command mpi run uh, mpi run uh, the process for slash uh, my output file so in here I got uh, a warning there are not enough slots available in the system so I can only use up to two process so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this command over subscribe subscribe and then I'm going to specify the number of process and my output file so if I use the oversubscribe uh, command, then only I can uh, run my, I can uh, run until the number of process that I determine, because I uh, uh, currently my virtual machine only stick to two slots at one time. So I can only two, I can only perform two uh, process uh, at one time. So this is uh, for my the first hello world, the the very basic just to test our MPI. A command uh, running uh, smoothly so the next one is uh, the, the 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 source code with the error so let me clear the screen first okay we're gonna go for the cc so since just now i use the test now i will use the test one hello world one dot c so as we can see there are warnings here errors uh, return type defaults to integer so uh, we can straight away fix the error from here using the gedit command and the name of the file so we'll open the text editor so from here we can see that actually uh, we are using integer property and there are some uh, arguments in this uh, in this uh, main function so therefore we need to specify the integer here and a basic uh, return zero method here so uh, we're gonna go uh, a bit further in this coding as i can explain what i understand uh, from the mpi module so we create three variables mpi error mpes and my rank so uh, the first one is MPI initial so this is for uh, to initiate the parallel computation and this one is for MPI comp size is uh, to determine the number of process in our communicator as we know comp stands for the communicator MPI and next is MPI comp rank which is to determine the rank of process uh, we are at which process 1, 2, 3 or 4 
and then we do some uh, a little bit uh, condition here if uh, our my rank holds a value of 2 then we go into this uh, into this if statement that will print welcome and greeting process uh, 2 so later when we run this uh, program uh, whenever the my rank process uh, the my rank holds a value 2 it will print from process 2 out of 4 hello world and it will go inside this if statement and print welcome a greeting from process 2 so MPI error MPI finalize which is to shut down the parallel computation so now we're gonna go and save these changes and we go to our terminal okay so now we can perform MPI CC O. I'm gonna give my output file in test one from hello world one dot c. See, as we can see, there are no error here. We have fixed the error now. If I can ls to see what, uh, to see whether the test uh, one is in the list. So as we can see, the test one is in the list, and now I can just simply run the test one. And it, 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 it runs uh, from process 0 out of 1. Uh, same as just now, we can uh, specify the number of process we want it to run at one time. So I'm going to use the MPI run. And use the over subscribe command to uh, fulfill the 4 process at a time. And specify the number of process up to 4. And uh, the name of my file so as we can see now it uh, lists from process uh, all the process one two three and four uh, as and we can see whenever it uh, it meets uh, from process two which means our rank value is now equal to two it also will go into the if statement and print this line welcome a greeting from process two so uh, that's uh, that's all uh, for this video I think I showed the basic uh, C uh, program file that uh, I can uh, we can perform the MPI command and the second one is to fix the error uh, and a little bit explanation of what I understand for MPI basic routines which is the initial uh, we check the communicator size and we check the rank and we finally close the parallel the, the parallel computation so I'm gonna go clear my terminal and close uh, and uh, I think uh, that's all uh, from this video. Uh, so thank you, Dr. Lisa.